well, it's a real person. I play Neil Spohr, who was one of the fathers of sort of quantum physics, uh, debated with uh, Einstein, some really significant figure in 20th century physics. So there's lots to read about. He, uh, he's Danish, and he had lots of he had lots of interest in sports. He had an interesting life. He had six children. It was somebody whose science and whose life were very rich. So I was encouraged to go read it and uh, and also um, to call on my own experiences of visiting Los Alamos, where the, his involvement in the story takes place. Uh, his work ethic is extraordinary. Uh, his capacity for fun and inventiveness. He can handle massive scale, but he can give the actors time and care and consideration in the middle of it all in a way that is very, very pleasing and unusual. He's complex. He's sexy. Uh, he's you imagine him as being a man who could persuade people to do all sorts of things, including fund this extraordinary city in the desert that would produce a world-changing substance. Um, and so Killian can think with um, a capacity to compel the audience. He has energy, has vitality. Uh, it's a sublime performance from him. You will feel things in the film that are as a result of Chris Nolan and his commitment to IMAX presenting an entertainment that is so compulsive and so complete, so visceral. It's not just ideas, it's the soul, it's the heart about something that affects all of us and could have changed the history of this planet, its consequences continue to, to influence that. So it couldn't be more important story uh, more with a more important and appropriate filmmaker. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Hey You Guys! Hey you guys! <laughs> hey you guys! <laughs> hey, that's what they all say. Hey you guys! Hey you guys!